Hello, I'm Kika Stego, and this is Bug Fables, the Everlasting Sapling. Uh, I got told about this game because I really love the Paper Mario series, and it's kind of like a spiritual successor. And it already crashed my computer once and corrupted the file footage, so I've actually already played about the first hour of the game. So, just to preference that, I do know, like, <laughs> a little bit of it, but I, so I'll tell you, like, oh, I remember predicting this because it is so, like, predictable in some spots, but it's so fun. It is very much like the Paper Mario game. So, let's, uh, stop the jibber-jabber and get right into it. Yeah, we don't need this anymore. So, I hate to say that, but we're deleting that. We got a little, like, like you saw, 45 minutes in. It wasn't, like, much. Okay, we're gonna be key again. Because it's perfectly spaced out for me, and that makes it nice. Yes, key is okay. Is she, though? Okay, we got some plot. Ah, the land of Bulgaria, a peaceful, prosperous place where many adventurous bugs gather. Although it wasn't always that way. Lured by the promise of riches and lush fields, a young queen visited these lands many moons ago. Together with her daughters and fellow ant servants, she established Bulgaria's modest first settlement. Her people were happy, the ant kingdom flourished, and yet the queen's dream still had not yet been fulfilled. For she had heard of an ancient people who safeguarded treasure. Of unfathomable power. <laughs> the everlasting sapling, a plant which would great unending youth and strength to anyone who ate even one of its leaves. She searched, she searched, and searched, and alas, she never found it. She entrusted her dream to the princess before falling onto hard-earned sleep. Determined to succeed where her mother did not, the new queen rallied the people together under her cause. Opening the doors of the kingdom to bugs of all shapes and kinds, she attracted ambitious and skilled adventurers. Her decree was loud and clear. Find me the everlasting sapling, and you shall know wealth like no other bug ever has. With this, the Explorers Association was founded with its many members searching across the kingdom for clues and treasure. Even though to this day the sapling has not been found, but every bug dreams of one day claiming it for themselves. Okay. So we'll start off with our little band of rambunctious characters. Or at least those were the stories I was told by land. Despite many unfortunate incidents, tales of your people helped me keep adventuring spirit alive. Rest assured, Kabu, they are not mere legends, but real history. The Explorers Associates and all the Explorers who risked their wings for glory are proof of that. Then, Sir Makai, would you consider my earlier offer? Kabu, I respect your passion, but I take missions of the highest danger of unproven warriors not fit to accompany my team. Unproven? Makai, I've bested many hardships in the North. Or so you say, your knowledge of our culture and your passion for exploring are true as my blade's edge, Kabu. But I would ask you to not press the issue. This is a place to cause a scene. Yeah. What? Care to say that again? As I said, we cannot allow children to explore, much less snake mouth den. I'm not a kid. So much for that. Would you accompany me, Kabu? It's my duty to investigate. If you insist. <coughs> Use things to move and talk to people. Woo. Oh, Makai, he's getting ready to serve justice. No, he's just gonna cause a scene again, like always. Such a thing occurs frequently. Hey, didn't Makai ask for you? Don't make him wait or I'll make you pay. Jen, you're embarrassing me. This is not the head of the fangirl club. Yes, I am. I'm just gonna rock right out of this one. And there's this guy up here. 
Would you mind coming back in a bit later? Look at all this darn paperwork. I shouldn't disrupt his work. Greetings, Explorer. What do you want? You shouldn't be keeping the guy waiting. He's right. Why am I up here? Because I'm exploring, that's why. Etel B, lower your voices. What is the matter? This guy's calling me a kid. He says, I don't know if I should do different voices. This guy's calling me a kid. Says I can't explore. Shouting is going to change the rules, you child. Shut it. It's not about age. It's about skill. I'm V, the best explorer the hive has ever seen. I'm not some random B. An explorer B? Yeah, got a problem? Say bees can't explore expected honey and paint. I didn't say that, but... Silence, please. This guild of ours is no place for petty squabbles. Look, I can't give a permit to some bee, much less a partner team should be a duo of explorers, you know? I'm worth like four bees, okay? Because I kind of got the vibe of this character already. She's like a little bratty, kind of. Like, eh, I want to do what I want. Hey, V. What do you want? Why don't we join forces? We both wish for a permit, yet lack a companion. Why do I look like that desperate? I don't even know you. I have a promise, but I, I must keep. And for that, I must explore. How bad could it be? Well, I can't be worse than having to stay put. Deal. Wait, you two are just crazy. You won't last a second of snake mouth. I'll prove you wrong. No. You're both most likely mere novices ruled by your strong emotions. I have no doubt that if you left today, you would return inside a bag. Sir Mackay, although you outrank me in spades, you shouldn't underestimate me. I went through quite a bit to get here. Yeah, bugs like you look down on others are real annoying. Um, very well. I shall test your resolve. Test us? How? Who, na who named you king of this joint? The Aunt Queen herself. She has knighted me as her royal blade. I accept your challenge, V. Get ready. Watch your own horde. I was born ready. Okay. So... I bet I know more. I bet I know more stuff than you do. I'll be fine. Um it's just like Paper Mario. <laughs> so if you know those controls, you pretty much know these ones. All right, I shall trust you then. Okay, yeah, it's like your standard woo. How you do the standard hits and everything. Hold this down, release it. See, we're doing great. Don't let your guard down, V. After our turn ends, the enemy's next. Plus, say at the right time to block. And perfect timing, same as Mario. Um, obviously I haven't played this much to, like, master the- Like, seems like the blocking is kind of a little bit off of where Mario, the first two Paper Mario games would have been. But, hey, it's a different game, so. Oh, he called her little boomerang a silly toy. Toy, ugh, now I'm mad, her beamerang. We should pay it back tenfold. It's time to use a skill. They're just like attacks, but you select them from the yellow flower. Skills require us to use our TP, though. So watch out for how many we have left. We should patch your wounds, too, using items from the blue flower. Toggle between commands. Okay, so... I want to use our skills. Tornado toss. Boom, boom, boom. Unbelie unbelievable. And then his is just like a taunt to make him focus on him. So we'll do another tornado toss, because why not? And they give us a crunchy leaf, which is like your healing. Your start off healing items. Oop, 
forgot to block. <laughs> Just that skill with the blade. You pass. What? You performed well enough. I could feel your desire to see the world through your acts. I'm no one to keep you from your explorer permit until you may grant it to them. I get to s I get no say in this, huh? But Makai is the queen's blade. Here you can have it. Explorer permit. I did it. Snake Mouth Den is going to be all mine. All the riches, all the glory. Snake Mouth Den, it lies to the west of the association. A simple path, although filled with danger. There's much treasure to be found, but this jaws have claimed many. Makai! Seriously, brother, how long are you going to keep you waiting? My apologies, Kina. V, Kabu, I must be going now. As you can see, duty calls me. May you succeed in your mission. What a weird bunch. He ended up causing quite the scene himself. That fighting prowess, how many years of, must he have trained? So, uh, V, I guess, from the hive near the big tree. Oh, I'm Kabu. I moved just one moon ago from the north. Cool. Indeed. Um, Sir Makai said Snakemouth was to the west, right? Should we get moving? Right, uh, yeah, let's go right away. Don't fall behind, okay? Hey, wait, you two. Something wrong? You know what the goal of Snake Mouth Expedition is, right? Yeah, get the, get the thing, get the plant. Alright, I hope you can find the ancient artifact the queen is after. Good luck out there. Thank you, we'll be back soon, I promise. Okay, chapter one. A dysfunctional trio. There's another character. I already met him. Uh, I have no idea what voice to give him. Change the party leader by pressing X. You can change. Okay. Yeah, so it's kind of like... That's a little different. I, I can't remember if you did that in Paper Mario or not, but... I know, like, you'd swap out your partners and you'd have different abilities, but these you actually, like, switch between in-world. In Whew, finally done. Some work just doesn't stop coming. Oh, okay. Who are you again? Excuse, yeah? I'm artist, and I keep this place running. Oh, thank you for all your hard work. Oh, uh, yeah, thanks. You two faced Makai, eh? Bet you found it a tad too easy? You know it. Yeah, I see. A lot like challenge. One sec, I have this one thing. Please take it. And he gives us a hard mode battle. It seems like it doesn't really give you that much of a bonus, at least for right now. Maybe when you get stronger later, it's like a good thing to use. Quit the medals. Yeah, it's just like traditional Paper Mario. What is this, a medal? Let's say it should make things more interesting to you. The higher the risk, the higher the reward. As they say, you defeat a powerful enemy, well, worry, come see me, alright? I won't say no to free stuff, you got a deal. Thank you for entrusting us with it. Take care, artists. Safe exploring, folks. Remember to check in every now and then. Okay, yeah, we'll check in with him. Good showing, not many Stan Mackay's blade. Why, thank you. I see you've endured it as well. Anyone who belongs to the association could say at least that much. Whoa, so everyone here is crazy strong? Or they found a reliable partner to carry them. Why, you try to say something? Not at all. If you're offended by it, it only shows your insecurity. What's your deal? You want to fight? Enough, B. We got granted our permit. Let's not get into trouble. Yeah, good luck, you two. You're going to need it. Yeah, I think I'll make a uh, green boy here, my normal voice. V is going to be the little bit of high voice. And when we meet the other guy, he'll be like a little bit of a deeper voice. And if we get more people past that, I'll figure something out. I don't know. Or I might drop it all together because, I don't know, I've never done that before and it might be annoying people. Fangirl, what's up? Oh, Aerie, why must Makai be so dreamy? Have you gone mad, Jen? He's so arrogant. You tell her, Aerie. Pompous as he was, he was at least enough, kind enough to test us. Oh no, he does that to everyone. You see this once a week. Oh, Makai, such a show-off. Ugh, that stupid role-playing wannabe 
Ugh, that stupid role-playing wannabe gatekeeper. I'll show him. This will not stand. I shall challenge him to a duel to the death and honor on the line. Hey, uh, you don't have to go that far. Oh, um, he's just kidding, right, Kabu? Uh, yes, of course, kidding. I was most certainly only jesting. You better have been. Let's just go, Ka Let's just go, Kabu. Okay. So. Ding. Hey, why you hit that crystal? You can break it, you know. Huh? You really don't know? Just tell us why. Forgive my partner, Celia. Her mouth is most loose. This is an ancient crystal, correct? They're unique to this island. Correct. They could store the record of previous travelers if you smack them with something. This crystal is yellow, so it will even heal your wounds. You expect me to believe that? All that awesome stuff for hitting a rock? Yeah, you are one of little faith. Come on, Levy, show him. Yes. Saving. Please stand by. Save completed. It is done. Wow, it really works. This must sell for a fortune. All you get for this crystal is prison time. Only the Ant Queen can authorize placing these rocks in public spaces. Even if you find one in the wild, they're too heavy to be carried by a single bug. There goes that idea. Still, the properties are amazing. Let's use what we can buy. Yeah, sure. Let's get a move on. Best of luck. Then we got some merchants hanging out over here and their sad little, uh, little slug friend. They're all saying how the past blocked by some rocks. Ugh, I should have gone to the city earlier. Now I have to wait until this mess is cleared. I understand my wife is upset, but there's nothing we can do until the rocks are cleared. Ugh, these rocks are getting in the way of our trade routes. If it isn't cleared soon, we'll lose money. Get on with it, Ants. This should never have happened. Being rude to the Ants. Not cool. North Ant Kingdom, West Snake Mouth Way, South Golden Path. Guess I'm not allowed to. Yeah, there's rocks in the way. Okay, we got Shizgar Pass. The path ahead leads to Snake Mouth Den. Currently, only licensed exploration teams can pass. Do you have a permit? Yep. Alright, this checks out. I'll open the gate. Safe travelers, explorers. And I'll go back and save just so if I die, I don't have to do all that again. Because I died a couple times last time just making... I also was trying to do it with hard mode, which was pretty my bad. So what's going on here? Hmm. Never noticed that before. But, yeah, I was trying to do hard mode. So, I died a few times. And then there was a save stone later that... I play a lot of, like, PC. So, like, this is the Xbox controller. But I also play a lot of Nintendo Switch. And I kept on messing up my button placement. So, that was like a big reason why I was dying so much. <laughs> so, if I uh, swap, I can throw my beamerang at this thing and stun it so I can uh, get an extra attack. Kind of like how you would in a traditional Paper Mario. And obviously, I'll uh, spare you, like I do in most of the games that I play, all the battling sequences, because, oh my god. It gets to be so much sometimes. Yeah, like these ones, you gotta knock them down with V, and then Kabu can... Uh, Smack him. Thank you. 
Okay. Got a little old man over there. He will actually, uh, teach us how to do the thing I'm doing right now. <laughs> Cutting grass. Excuse me, bug of old complexion. Is everything all right? Hey, Kamu, we're supposed to be adventuring. Snake about that endless riches. Sorry, Vi, I can't ignore an old bug in distress. First of all, name's Chuck, and I bet I'm younger than both of you. But if you gotta know, I'm almost done arranging my cozy rest space for travelers going to snake about that. I just can't pull this darn weed. You called this cozy? Chuck, snake about that is more dangerous than rain on a wedding day. Should you be warning travelers? Like, I always thought like that was an expression because it was like meant to make the knot of your wedding stronger because you get a wet knot it's harder to take apart but okay whatever we'll just roll with it look will you help me out or not i'm not doing any i'm not doing any pulling at least not for free hum what Ugh. hum watch this vi if i press b in your bushes or small rocks Whoa, nice. Something like this is no match for my horn. It'll be you actually helped me. This made my week. You've got a reward ready, right? But Vi, helping others is already its own reward and you didn't do anything. But really, really not. Oh, oh no worries. Helpful bugs deserve gratitude. I ain't got much, but please take this. Ten berries. Berries, so many berries. Uh, use them to buy something nice later, all right? Thank you, we surely will. We'll be going now. Make sure to warn others of the danger. If you're near something that can be interacted with the horn, a explanation point will show up above the party leader's head. Yay. So, that's how we know we're supposed to cut those things. So, anything like that will show the green explanation point. Yeah, it's a sign about how to use the search function while you're in game to tell you more about like the enemy. Crap. <laughs> yeah, he can only attack on the floor. Kind of like a boppery kind of situation where he has no reaching attacks. So, he can... I'll taunt. Yeah, he has a better, like, defense. I know we get a lot of, yeah, items out of these bushes and stuff, so try to cut them up when we can, get some good healing upgrades. This is it, Snake about done. It doesn't look that scary. Oh. According to the rumors I have heard, it's is the grave of a thousand explorers. Having ended countless journeys, many a song have been written about its dangers. For real? Its interior must be absolutely riddled with monsters and death traps, so you must be extremely cautious. Jeez, way to sell it to me, Cabo. But the higher the danger, the better the treasure. Um, is that true that the artifact is likely to be inside, but there are simple riches worth such a risk to you? Stop trying to scare me off. Let's get in there. I must make sure she stays safe. Okay. Cut all of our little bushies. Grab this thing. Crystal berry. You found a crystal berry. These are rare items sought by collectors around the world. Maybe someone will trade them for rare goodies somewhere. You can check how many you have in the pause menu. Yes, I would like to save. This is where I didn't save before. I was kept on getting mad at myself. Okay.
There's much more light here. This room must be quite near the cracked ceiling. What a surprisingly cozy entrance. Ah, Kaboo, do you really have to comment on every small thing? I I'm sorry. Hey, don't look so sad. Or er, how about this? If I want to know more about where we are or something or someone near us, just tap left. Does that sound good? Very well. I'll make sure to have information at hand for you when you do. Cool. Now let's keep going. Okay, these little guys over here, we can uh, flip. Yeah. He got us first. Of course he's going for my little bug buddy. some mild puzzling. Use the beam ring, grab your items. Your traditional mild puzzling. The bridge seems to be out. How are we going to cross? Well, that's it. Game over. Let's go back. Wait, V, hold on. This is too soon to give up. There must be a way. Duh, I was kidding, you know. Look over there. That's one of those ancient switches. We just need to hit it. You can just fly over to it, right? That's too much effort. I got a better plan. My mighty beamerang and just blah, 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 use buttons to throw it. I will trust you with this, then. Give it your best shot. Woo, that's totally what she meant to do. Well done, V. That I was expecting you to do that. Uh, yeah, of course. This is planned. Let's continue. I'm glad to have a reliable partner. Super reliable. Okay, so let's switch back to him. Investigate this thing. Seems to be broken. Okay. Yeah. Nice little area. Got another buzzy butt. Yeah, they're really good at sensing you, so I probably. I don't know if you can knock them out with a uh, B or V. On the overworld or not to be honest a fit egg what does this say leave this place for beyond this point lies great danger We've already lost one of ours this wretched place. Curses. This coziness was an illusion. Our path won't be easy, that's much for sure. No place full of treasure has ever been safe. So many have fallen looking for riches. Let's find the treasure quickly so no one else ventures in here. I will do this for them. Okay. Cool, cool. Let's, uh... Give her a little egg. Get her... Keep her going. Yeah. 